It's time for Ryan's Roses. Uh, all right. I'm desperate to hear what's going on on mm-hmm. this one. I don't even understand it myself, to be honest with you. So she says, uh, my husband and I are in the process of getting a divorce. Turns out our Uber apps are still linked, so I see where he goes. There is a whole hour. Oh, so I, she still gets like the emails from Uber. I noticed she- he went to my sister's house a few Saturdays ago. I tried to justify it. Maybe you know someone nearby, but I didn't bring it up to my sister just in case. I didn't want to tip them off. <laughs> sure enough, last Saturday, he went over there again. I know he's not cheating on me because we went through his divorce, but I need to know if he is seeing my sister. Olivia, I have a question for you here. Thanks for coming on in Silmar, and I'm sorry you're going through this, but my question is, what was the reason for your divorce? It wasn't your sister, was it? No, no. He just told me he fell out of love. It's just really sad for me, but, you know, I want him to be happy. So yeah. he initiated it. How long were you married? We were married. Well, we were together for 20 years. We have three kids. Okay. There, to me, there's no reason why he should be seeing your sister or your sister seeing him without her telling you. Like, there's just, there's no justification for that in my mind at all. I mean, this is your sister. She knows you're going through a divorce. She should be reporting to you whatever's going on if he's going over there and to talk to her. Because it's possible that he's talking to her, but she should be telling you that. Yeah. You know, it's sketchy that she's not. No. How old are your kids? They are from 10 to 15, 10, 12, and 15. 10, 12, and 15. Is it possible that he may be getting an Uber for the kids to go to your sister's house and she could watch them or something? And so it's just on oh, his no. account? No, no, Not at all, because I'm with the kids at the time that he oh. goes. Oh, okay. So all right. do you, is it like, is this within your sister to do? To mess around with your Yeah, what's your guys' ex? relationship like? I mean, it's good, although I have to say she's been distant the last few months, you know. Out I'm of guilt, like and I maybe. can't mm, I don't know. I mean, it's just it's all coming together in a weird way. So I have a bad feeling. Okay. We need no more. Hang on one second, Olivia. We'll make the call next. This is an interesting Ryan's Roses if you just got here. Olivia, she's going through a divorce, so she knows her husband isn't cheating. But she thinks her husband is getting too comfortable with her sister because she's found out that he's been over at her place several Saturdays. Mm -hmm. And, I mean, the real issue here is her sister's not telling her. Right. And they're going through a divorce. That is sketchy to me. Mm -hmm. I don't understand it. I can't quite figure it out. Uh, But, Olivia, we're going to call your... Is he your ex yet? Or are you still married? What's the technical... Well, technically, it will be finalized soon. Been broken up since February. So, and what, what is your sister's name? My sister's name is Megan. All right, here's what we're going to do, Olivia. We are going to call your soon to be ex husband and okay. find out who he sends roses to. Okay, well, hopefully, it's I don't know. I mean, <laughs> would he send them to you? I guess we're not hoping it's you, know. but we'll know if he's so. Sent- you basically let's- don't want him to send them to your sister, but yeah. It could be it's almost sister. like better somebody else. All right, let's find out. Let's just get to it. Let's find out what's going on. Um. Olivia, I need you to say, Ryan, you my permission to call and then whatever his name is on KISS FM. Okay, Ryan, you have my permission to call on KISS FM. Okay, we are going to call him, offer him some roses, find out what he writes on the card, be very quiet until we come in and tell him he's on the air, okay? Okay. All right, good luck. Here we go. Thank you. Hello. Hi, can I speak to Eric? Uh, yeah, this is Eric. Can Hi. I ask who's calling? Hi, Eric. My name is Talia. I'm calling from Sweet Blooms and more. We're a new flower shop here on Polk Street. Oh, okay. You were right near, um, like, we're on the corner of Glen Oaks and Polk, pretty much, like, by that little Caesars. Oh, okay. Well, uh, welcome to the area. Uh, the, the reason why I'm calling, actually, is because we're giving away a dozen roses that you could send to anybody today. We're just trying to promote our new flower shop and delivery service and things like that. And so we hope that you could send them to somebody and then refer us to friends and family. That's 
pretty cool. There's no catch or anything. To um, it. nope. We just ask that you, you know, put in a good word for us, or whoever receives the flowers, you know, ends up putting a good word for us. And I don't need credit card info or billing info or any cash from you. Just the name of the person that you want to send them to. Uh, well, this sounds a little too good to be true, but all right, uh, I'll do it. I'm in. Um, okay, okay so what all do you need from me exactly? Um, well, we have red, yellow, pink, or white roses. Which color would you like to send? Uh, I'll go with pink roses. Pink roses, okay. And then w- tell me the name of the person you want to send them to. Uh, Megan. Megan, okay. And then we have a bunch of different occasion cards that you can choose from. Birthday, anniversary, love, I'm sorry. Um, can I just do like a custom message or a note yeah. or something like that? So like we can do a playing card. Okay, what would you like to put on the note? Uh, can you put on the note to new beginning? To new Eric, beginning. Eric, sorry, sorry, Eric, it's Ryan Seacrest, and we have your uh, soon-to-be ex-wife, Olivia, on the phone. Megan's sister, your voice is being broadcast on the radio. Wh- what is going on with her sister, a new beginnings with your sister-in-law? Is that what that is? Uh, are you, Eric, are you kidding me? Are you? Kidding no, me. We're on the radio right now? What? what why? Eric, Eric. Sister Eric. Eric, are you romantically involved with your soon to be ex wife's sister and she doesn't know about it? What does it matter? She's my ex wife. Like, it doesn't matter. We're not together anymore. It's none of her business what I'm doing with her. None of my business. Me? It is totally my business if you cheated on me with my sister, Eric. Are you kidding cheated me? Cheated on you with your sister. We're not together anymore. How, I can't. Like, what, what, why are you giving. Why do you care what I'm doing? Why because it's her family. Yeah. It's my family. What's Eric? the matter with you? How long has this even been going on? What is your problem? Th- th- this I has, knew this it. is I nothing. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't have nothing to do with me. Questions at all. Why, why? You are. You disgust me. This is disgusting. How long it's have you been doing this? It's disgusting to me sister? that you are invading my privacy like this. How privacy? Even, how do you even know? How do you even know what's happening? How, well, how, Eric. Eric. Tone it down for a second because your ex-wife who you spent half your life with has just realized that you have cheated on her and if not, been secretively messing around with her sister who now is not being truthful with her. Neither are you. So I think you need to back your tone off a little bit. I I need to back my tone off. You need to just back your tone off a little bit. What is going on with you and Megan, your soon-to-be ex-wife sister? So you're 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 not cheating, fine, but don't you find it a little odd that you be tiptoeing around and the fact that her sister isn't talking about it just adds to the crypticness of this? It's none of your damn business what we're doing. This Why is, is he so oh angry? Goodbye. Goodbye. How so dare you? Why is he so oh angry? What's going what, what Why is he oh so angry, God. Olivia? What has happened to make oh him so angry? I don't know. I'm disgusted. I am absolutely disgusted. I mean, I, I, look, you have to get to your sister, too, because the fact that your own oh sister's not talking to you, and now, how long is have they been doing this behind your back, I'm asking? A mess. I don't even know. I am shocked. <sighs> I am beside myself. This is so horrible. Yeah, it's uh, there's nothing good about it. Um, nothing good about it. And I'm, I, I look, it's all bad. I don't understand his anger. His anger is not. His anger, is, his anger is guilt. His anger is no, because he knows this but, is bad. But you guys have known each other for such a long time. I the anger seemed off to me, Olivia. I don't know something. Something not right. Oh, hey, hang on one second. Hang on one second. He the anger is not adding up to me. I just, Something's I'm not, like, we don't I'm know honestly something. speechless from this But we whole don't situation. know something. I'm telling you, we don't know something. We don't know something. We don't know. You, he's way too angry. We don't have all the facts. It's all, okay. it's all bad, but we don't have all the facts. Something to the puzzle we don't know. I'm telling you, sister. What? You said something to justify his anger? So he's There's something that's allowed made him angry? That? You think maybe and Olivia did something? I don't know. I'm just telling you, we don't have all the pieces. 